ready? Yep, you guys are good. Alright, hello everyone, this is Jaxus, this is Nintos. We're going to commentate the Swiss match between G-Man and Shy. Both really strong players, definitely. Uh, each playing their signature characters. Uh, G-Man actually has a slightly different loadout than normal though. He's running Rocket Barrel Attack, I think it's called. It's an update replacement for Diddy that is like obscenely strong but it sacks most of his recovery for it. Uh, yeah, that's interesting. Did he already felt like he had sort of a weaker recovery, so it seems like a kind of risky trade to make. Yeah, it still has the same distance, but it just doesn't go sideways, like, at all. Oh, interesting. I think we saw it, actually, uh, when G-Man was playing against uh, Zeno. Yeah. He sort of got a surprise up. He, it almost looked like a kill. Indeed. It, it kills really Whoa! Well. So, um, Shy's actually got the lead right now with his yeah, well, Luigi like, down air combos. Yeah. Luigi has a pretty good matchup against Diddy, honestly, because Diddy's strength is getting grabs, and That's Luigi's also weakness Luigi. is, like, he can't get in to get the grabs, but if Diddy's already there, yeah, then... Uh, yeah, Luigi also works off of lots of grabs, and he has that uh, frame three, I think it is, Nair, yep. that comes out and breaks up a lot of... Uh, Aerial chains, so that's something that Diddy doesn't like. Oh, yeah. Uh, Shy had a good mix up right there. It looked like he was going for the edge with the tornado and then just came through and hit him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Went above Diddy. That is not somewhere you ever want to be. Though, I mean, a little bit less so post match, but it's still not good. Yeah. So, G Man's been making up. Uh, we've got the volcano stalemate going on. This happens a lot in this segment of the stage, I feel like. Yeah. No one really wants to make an approach on the other character. Um, coming down from above. Mm -hmm. But G-Man's been slowly making up the percent. Um, <laughs> tries barely with the forward smash. Yeah, he was probably expecting Shy to roll into him. Mm -hmm. Just because of the distance that was already there. Oh, he's caught the grab and the back row smashes it, yep. So Shy had the lead, but G-Man caught up and took the first stock. So he's gonna have to find a way to take G-Man's stock. Luckily, he's at the percentage where a lot of Shy's uh, like kill confirms off of throws will kill confirm. Yeah, <laughs> especially on um, the down the Luigi tornado. Yeah, that something that we is... might. I would not be surprised if we see right here. Yep, yep. whiffed, but that's what we're going get for. It. Uh, G-Man's finally at the percent now, at like right around 150, where it's kind of iffy if the different throw combos will work, from what I've seen. Yeah. Shy's so definitely having a lot of trouble taking this first stock right now. So, um, Oak gets the grab. He did get the stock, um, finally. But, and he didn't take too much of a, Dead of a, yeah, he didn't, uh, get himself into too much of a hole, and he already climbed out of it, so. Yeah. Um, honestly, I would say that the kill power in this matchup, it favors Luigi now. Um, I mean, Diddy has his banana to forward smash, but other than that, he doesn't have just the, oh, I'm gonna up air you and you're gonna die yeah. thing. Yeah, Whereas Luigi has a lot more ways to get himself into a kill setup from the neutral. Yeah, though Rocket Barrel Attack can make up for that. Oh uh, yeah, but he did with it there. Yeah, um, trying to get a get a surprise. It's a very risky move to, uh, you know, sort of like Zero Suit's boost kick or something. Yeah, once you miss it, you're getting you're in for a hard punish, especially against oh, yeah. a player like Shy. Um, I don't know the actual kill percentages, but it's at least as strong as boost kick from what I've seen. Interesting. So, um, the percent's still going pretty even here. It seems like Shy has, uh, works really well when uh, his, when Diddy is at uh, zero or lower percent. Diddy with that banana in hand. What was the game deal? <laughs> Catches Luigi with it, but Luigi goes for a pack throw. They've been, uh, the boundary was a little surprisingly farther away than I thought it was going to be there. That looked yeah. like it could have a been even the stock, but that's a pretty wide segment of the stage, apparently. Mm -hmm. A lot of the uh, walk-off transitions are just huge. Which is surprising. I feel like it's the opposite in Delfino. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> and Delfino also has its blast zone shrink on transition. Oh, Ooh. wow. A very nice uh, Whoever gets this grab, that is going to be stock. Yeah. Oh, it's at the point where almost whoever gets the next grab is stock, assuming they follow it up correctly. Yeah. Oh, neither of them got it there. I'm scared. But both players are, pl are playing a little bit reserved right now, both very strongly aware that one screw up on their part is probably going to cost them this match. Yeah. <laughs> Starting a little bit of a projectile war, we're getting some <laughs> roasted peanuts. Roasted peanuts for sale here. 
fire lives on. <laughs> oh. Luigi adjusting so they can actually roast those peanuts a little better. Roast <laughs> banana peel. No. Oh. oh, wow. Misses his chance oh, to punish that roll. Try oh. gets caught by the fair, but oh, wasn't a strong hit. Yeah, and the misfire brings him right back. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Gets the down smash, and that's gonna be the first game to shy a very, very close set. Incredibly close. That okay, that that's right there came down to uh, if D Man had positioned the banana like half an inch to the left. Yeah. Shy would have tripped. Yeah, and a lot of people watching, a lot of hype reaction to that and Oh yeah. <laughs> Okay. All right, and looks like we're going to uh, find a destination for the next match. That Omega is going to be G Man's counter pick. Mega Port Town, and we got the Captain Falcon coming out. All right. Seems to be switching off of Diddy a lot today. Yeah, uh, Diddy hasn't been working out for him so far in his two sets he's done. Yeah. All right, so he's trying to get his home field advantage <laughs> here at Port Town. He's bringing out that Captain Falcon. We didn't see that Captain Falcon did us against Zeno, but... Yeah, he went Ganon in that match, right? Yep, it worked out for him, too. Missing the stage there, but manages to recover. Yep. It did lose him his Nair follow-up, but, I mean... Small price to pay for, you know, living. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, Shai's getting really solid Luigi combos, that up tilt, up air, back air. <laughs> um... Captain Falcon doesn't really have a good combo breaker move, so uh, Luigi's already amazing grab combos just get way better. <laughs> At the same time, Captain Falcon likes to start a lot of combos off of his own down throws. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure that Falcon has the uh, kill power in this matchup like quite a bit. Yeah. His smash attacks come out way faster than you expect. And they have some serious the range. Yeah. Plus that elbow comes out so far. He really steps into it. <laughs> oh! Rogue forward smash by Luigi catches G-Man as he lands. That's going to be first stock. Luigi is definitely at a percent where he's going to be careful, though. He gets stopped. Again. Gets back aired. G-Man's got stage control here. I heard it joked about before, though, that when you've got stage control against a Luigi, you've always got to play defensively, just in case Luigi misfires. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. G-Man, of all people, should know that from as a melee Luigi man. <laughs> uh, Jesse, can you get DJ, Fed, and Dask playing here? Oh, oh, we get the shield break and the Falcon Punch! Oh, wow! Dang. That was a forward error shield break on... Uh, Shy shield there. Or not forward air, forward smash. Alright. Finish it up with a uh, Falcon, Falcon punch. punch. Very hype. Oh man, I'm sad I missed the intro to that. <laughs> well, that's why we've got the save for <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Alright, but Luigi keeping the percent really high on Falcon, keeping his lead. Mm -hmm. uh, G Man's gonna have a pretty serious distance to make up here. But honestly, one good edge guard. If you get Luigi off stage, he doesn't have a bad recovery, but he has a predictable one. Just wow! Like that. Wow! Catches just Luigi like just slightly off the stage with a really good spike. That's gonna be second match going to G-Man. Yep, that. That's why you can never count Falcon out. Just yeah. you get he gets you off stage once and you die. <laughs> it was barely even off stage too. Yep. Let's see if he even stays Falcon. And he's going Ganondorf. Oh no. Shiman's third. Alright, let's, let's see this. Um, I'm going to assume he's using Wizard's Drop Kick and Dark Fists. Uh, along with that Warlock Blade, if we ever see yeah, him out. Yeah, probably. Oh, of course, we might actually see it if we get another Shield Break. Yeah, you know. Okay. This is this is going to be brutal. Ganondorf really <laughs> suffering this against the Luigi's combos. <laughs> of course, nope. Ganondorf yeah. gets two hits on Luigi, and the it percent is, is even, even again. Oh wow! In the oh, it off. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you you can regret going Ganon all you want, and then you make him regret not being Ganon. <laughs> Shy definitely still has a shot here, though. Of course. Uh, he just has to be a little uh, safe, make sure that kind of stuff doesn't happen to him anymore. Oh, okay. He's got to be safe at the edge, or else that game inside is just going to end it. Mm-hmm. Oh, 
Luigi's traction making a lot of stuff way more safe on shield than it really should be. Yeah, for Ganondorf here. We're getting to up. Oh, wow. I'm not even totally sure what happened on there. I think he didn't get down up beat high enough. Get him up on the match. Yeah. yeah, but. Wow, okay, that was that was quite a turnaround. Yeah, it seems like Gandalf may actually be G-Man's strongest character. Yeah, it's going to be you versus Pineapple up.